now we're looking at an exponential equation that we can't change the base uh, to be the same on one side. So what do we do in those instances? Well, we can take the logarithm of both sides and then use the properties of logarithms in order to solve. So this one we're asked to solve, 7 to the x equals 43. How do we go about that? As we isolate the exponential, in this case it's already isolated, uh, and then we just take the log of both sides. So we can use the natural log or we can use uh, log base 10. Either one should work because it will uh, be easily figured in your calculator. So we'll start with log base 10. So log base 10 of 7 to the x equals log base 10 of 43. We use the power property. This becomes x log of 7 equals log of 43. So x equals log of 43 divided by the log of 7. Now we could have just as easily taken the natural logarithm on both sides. The ln of 7 to the x equals the ln of 43. That's going to eventually give us x equals the ln of 43 divided by the ln of 7, the natural log of 7. Either way, you put either one of these into your calculator, you should get the decimal approximation, x equals 1.933. So again, exponential function where we can't uh, put it in the same base, isolate the exponential, and then take the logarithm of both sides. And it doesn't matter which logarithm you use, uh, we're simply putting that in so we can use our calculator. So you could use log base 10, or you could use the natural logarithm, whichever you prefer.